you know that nowadays the mass custom room that we use is Vimos Pro. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you one room of Vimos Pro that is really light. It works on one gigabyte of memory RAM. Preferably, it worked on one gigabyte of memory RAM. So, so hello guys, and welcome to a brand new video. And if you didn't subscribe it yet, please subscribe to my channel, hit the bell icon to get notified when I upload new video, like the video, share the video with your friend guys, and let's get started. First of all, what I need to do is just follow my steps. This is the advice that I give you, follow my step till the end. Alright, so you're gonna download the two versions of Imos Pro that we leave down there. The so first of all what you need to do is download the room and the application that i will leave down there the link so easily you can have a custom room in your android device without wrp without pc without harm your device easily by installing on one android app okay so then what you download it you're gonna create one folder in your internal storage you wanna go down here in our internal storage and you're gonna create one folder name it you're gonna create one folder name it Vimos Pro perfect create folder then you're gonna open the Vimos Pro folder and create another folder name it backup so you're gonna create the folder name it backup then you're gonna move the Vimos Pro Light Room Room to this folder. Okay, guys, move it to the backup folder. As I, as I did here, Vimos Pro and backup folder. The room is here to so max stage. Vimos Light One backup. Okay, move it here, and you're gonna verify if the room is already here on the backup folder. Once we did this, we're gonna return. Now it's time to go in our settings, and we need to activate here the developer option. By doing that, we're gonna click on system and click in about phone. And we're gonna click right over here on build num around seven time to activate the build to activate the developer option. So as you can see, I have already activated this option, so it will not be available to activate it again. So I will return and I will open here the developer option. So I'm using Android 9. In your case, it can be different. So you have to look for the developer option around here on the same thing. So I'm gonna open and click on the developer option because I need to activate some setting here. And guys, be careful to not activate what you don't know. So I'm gonna click it over here down. I'm gonna enable this option USB the booting mode. Okay, let's click OK. Then we need to activate here the force full GNSS measurement. Click it over here. Then I'm gonna go down here and enable GPU the book liar. Click in this option. Then let's go down here and let's activate this three option here. Window animation scale, let's put it on 0 0.5. Okay, and transition animation scale, you can put it in 0 0.5. And sometimes if your phone has less than one gigabyte of memory RAM, you can turn it off. So in my case, I have four gigabyte of memory RAM. I'm gonna put it on 0 0.5. Okay, in animator transition, in major duration scale, we're gonna put it on 0.5. Once we do this, we're gonna go down here as well. We're gonna put on force GPU rendering and we're gonna enable this option. Perfect. Once we activate that, we're gonna force 4x MSAA and we're gonna enable this option. Perfect. We did this and now it's time to just return. By doing this, we're gonna see that your phone has. You're gonna see that your phone is working really fast okay guys let's clock our apps here and now it's time to open our vimos pro app so if you already installed your vimos pro we're gonna go to this process because i have already installed my vimos pro and now i'm going to activate some settings here i'm going to give some permission to the vimos pro to let the vimos pro read my storage my phone and my camera okay let's wait here so you will face it like this and you're gonna click on this blue icon here vimos pro so we're gonna swipe it and you're gonna in click on enter vimos pro so now it's time to click on this blue icon and you're gonna allow here 
perfect by doing that it will face like this if it means that my phone has not internet connection but it's easily we can close the Vimos Pro app and we're gonna reopen it I will open it my Vimos Pro and it will show up like this so you're gonna click on add then you're gonna click on this street that up here on the right corner so you're gonna click on the first option remember click on the first option here it isn't Chinese but you're gonna click on the first option if you did the if you did all I said before it will it will show up here so you will, you will be able to install your room into your Vimos Pro so remember guys these videos you must watch if you want some change it some custom room from my YouTube channel please subscribe because I bring here some rooms needful rooms to you gaming rooms and uh, apes rooms you're gonna face it you're gonna install these rooms in your android and you're gonna try one of them if one of them works to you it's good you can type down there on the comment and let me know if the room is good or not i always bring a new room here to you guys so click to install the room and just wait to installation for the installation please watch the video till the end because there's more tip how how to activate a root how to activate the setting there inside of the room okay guys i'm gonna be waiting here the room installation then i will be back soon As you can see, as you can see, portfolio this is working. This room has only this icon here. It doesn't need any my new super user camera gallery downloads and contact setting as well. So you're gonna click on the setting icon to activate here the developer option as well. Click down there and then we're gonna go in the in about phone and you're gonna click around seven times on build num. So here you're gonna know what to do because you learned it before you're gonna activate here the usb the body mo i mean the developer option so you're gonna click down here and then you're gonna click on usb the body mode and click ok if asks then you're gonna go down here and look for these three animations click all of them and put all of them on 0.5 perfect then click on force force gpu rendering then click on force f 4x msaa so now you have the room working properly and you can enjoy editing your videos and your games your apes so guys i will start from here i hope you like the video if you like the video please subscribe to my channel hit hit the bell icon to get notified when i upload a new video like the video and see you on the next one